Girl, I can't lie. Choose your character. Fight. Hi guys, it's Chi Chi. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a huge summer collective try on styling haul. As you guys know, I'm in the process of rebuilding my wardrobe. For the past two months, I've been accumulating a bunch of basics and now it's time for me to get into the essentials and I'm so excited. This whole haul is filled with essentials and a couple basics because you know, I'm still trying to get that too. So I've posted three fashion videos already the first one was a closet clean out and you saw me clean out my entire closet I got rid of 75% of my clothes that video will be linked down below and then the second video I made is a how to rebuild your wardrobe to fit a certain aesthetic where I just talked about tips and tricks that I use to efficiently build my new wardrobe and to find my new aesthetic that video will be linked down below too and in the last video the video that I just posted it's all about styling clothing and to basically where I tell you guys my tips and techniques on how I style my clothing to fit my body type, to fit my skin color, to fit my undertone, and all of that stuff. So that will be linked down below too. And in this video, I'm just going to be showing you guys a lot of the clothes that I've picked up. Um, I'm going to college soon and I'm trying to rebuild my closet. This is going to be the first time ever in my life that I get to wear anything I want to school. and. I'm just trying to be stylish. Period. I hope you enjoyed the haul and I also hope you enjoyed the styling portion. A lot of the tips that I use in this video I talked about in my styling video. Again, check it out. It's a good one. But yeah, if this is your first time watching my channel and you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you want to and let's get into it. So I'm gonna start with two pieces together, this scarf top and these white pants. This scarf top, I have been seeing all over Instagram. I swear everybody and their mother is wearing a scarf top. And since I am an unoriginal I had to jump on the bandwagon, so I bought one for myself. This is from Shein, it's patterned. I love the gold detailing in this because it matches my undertone. The material is not the greatest, it does feel a bit cheap, but then again, this is a scarf, so what do we expect? Um, but for a scarf top, the material doesn't really matter to me. It ties in the back and it looks super duper cute. I love it so much. And I paired it with these white pants. These white pants are probably my favorite thing out of the entire haul. It's a basic, even though it says it's an essential swap, but just let me live. I love this so much because this is straight leg denim that fits my waist. It is so hard for me to find pants that fit my waist. I always have to shop according to my butt, which isn't really that big, but whatever. I always have to shop according to my hips and then I'll later like tailor the waist, but I don't even have to do that with this. I love the material with this. It's really, really um strong and stiff, which I like with straight denim because it means that it will last for a long time. And that's what we want with our basic. We want our basics to last for a very long time. So for me personally, I'm okay with dropping a bag on basics. But the thing is, I got this from Shein, so I didn't even have to drop a bag. I dropped like $20. And like I said before, I styled these two pieces together. Okay, so this is the first outfit for the color scheme. I tried to go for gold and white. The gold is in the earrings and in the top and white is also in the top, the pants and the shoes. I absolutely love the way this outfit turned out. I think this is perfect for a summer day out with your friends, maybe, I don't know, going to a carnival or something. I don't know, I love this. It's super duper trendy and it's one of my favorite outfits. So the next thing I got is this cheetah top. It's a bit mesh and see-through, so I would recommend putting on some pasties if you're gonna wear this. This shirt is from Shein, and I'm telling y'all, it is for girls with small titties. If you got some big ass titties, do not buy this shirt. If you want support, you're not gonna find it here. But even though this shirt does not support your titties at all, you won't have a nip slip. And here's what I did to ensure that I don't get a nip slip with this shirt. So I wore the shirt regularly, right? And then I tied the back and then I used a safety pin and I put it in the back. I can be jumping, TikTok dancing, doing whatever I want. My boobs will be jumping as well, but my nipples won't be exposed. Here's how I styled this piece. 
Okay, so this is the next outfit that I styled. As you can see, the top is the essential piece and it's surrounded by basics. You know, personally for me, I have trouble styling cheetah. I feel like cheetah really can only be styled with their black or white items. I haven't seen a good outfit with cheetah styled with anything other than black, white, or brown. So to match the black that's also on the essential, I also paired this with a black jacket as well as black jeans. And for contrast, I paired this with Air Force One. Okay, listen y'all, I was not expecting this with this shirt. This is a flannel. I was expecting this flannel to be able to unbutton all the way through and for me to wear it and style it any which way, but that's not the case. At the end of the shirt, this just happens. I don't know what this is. At first, I hated it. I was like, what the f is this? What's she in trying to do to me? I just want a regular flannel and you're trying to play me. But then I actually wore it and I actually styled it and I loved it. It's This shirt is really nice and baggy and I styled this with baggy pants as well. So I'm going to just roll the clip. Okay, so the top, which was the essential piece, is giving off very cool undertones. So I also styled this with jeans that were a bit cool and I also styled this with Air Force Ones. I also paired this with um, gold earrings, but actually if I were to go back in time, I would pair this with silver earrings because the silver matches the jewelry on the Air Force Ones and it matches my belly ring. This ended up being one of my favorite outfits. Yeah, so that's how I styled it and I absolutely loved it. See, this just goes to show you that yeah, you may hate a piece on its own, but if you know how to style it, then you're going to love it. This brown basic bodysuit from Pretty Little Thing is the next thing. This is very Kim Kardashian of me. It's a very spandex material, so you don't really need to wear a bra with this. It kind of makes you look flat chested anyway. And honestly, with a shirt like this, you can style it up or down. I absolutely love the color. It's a nice dark brown, and it looks so good on my skin color. When it comes to styling, you can style it up or down, but in the styling portion of this video, I decided to style it up, and here's how I did that. So this is an example of a basic outfit because I used only basic clothes to style it. Um, the top's pretty basic. It was nice brown, pretty little thing. I love these white pants that I got from Honey Bum a while ago. I thought those would look really, really good together. And I'm also wearing clear heels that I got from Boohoo a while back. But girl, don't be looking at my toes too closely because I haven't, I haven't visited my nails in a long time. So everything that I'm showing you in the haul from now on, I can style because... I'm lazy. First things first, I got this top from Shein. I love it so much. It's a halter top, which I don't own. So this is my first halter top. Looks real cute. I love it so much. It's really form-fitting around the boob, but it gets a bit loose around the waist. I really do like this, but I just wish it was a bit more form-fitting when it went to the waist. I love the color though. The burnt orange, deep shades, muted colors. Looks good on me, love it. The next thing I got, I actually already showed you. If you watched my How I Style My Outfits video, you saw that I was wearing this very little thing top. It's like this Renaissance theme and it's mesh. So I would recommend wearing a brown, white or black bra with this. Um, I usually wear a black strapless bra whenever I wear this shirt. This shirt's also on my Instagram. So yeah, and on my Instagram, I just styled this with some basic straight leg denim jeans. This is an example of an Instagram worthy top. It looks good on Instagram, but it does not do in real life. The bottom isn't snug. So if you wear this out, you're gonna have to constantly pull it down, pull it down, pull it down, and that's so annoying. I think I might put this on my Depop because it's cute for Instagram, but not so cute for real life. Okay, the next piece was actually gifted to me by Opali. It's this beautiful form-fitting dress. My favorite thing about this dress is the neckline. Like, guys, look at this. It's giving devil. I love it. And there are these scrunches on the side that I absolutely love. This dress looks really nice and slimming on me, especially since I lost all that weight because of the rice and vegetables that I just consumed for two weeks. But yeah, really cute dress. I love the color, guys. So you'll be seeing this dress on my Instagram really soon. Okay, so the last thing from this haul is from Shein. It is this trendy tie top. I've been seeing this tie top all over and i mean all over instagram and i absolutely love the style but what i love more about this is actually the color the color is a really nice bright but deep 
shaded yellow. Actually, for me, I would have loved this even more if it was just a bit deeper in shade, but this can definitely work. With dark skin, if you're ever trying to go for a very contrasting look, go for a bright, deep shaded colors. Those are the colors that complement you better. This is a perfect example of something that would look really good in contrast with my skin. And that's exactly what I was thinking when I picked up this shirt. Again, I would have loved this shirt even more if the shade was a bit deeper, but still, this shirt is very gorgeous. I love it so much. Yeah, and that's it. That's it for the whole haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the clothes that I got and seeing how I styled a couple of them. Um, if you guys liked the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more content from me, and I'll see you guys in my next Girl, one. I Bye. Can't lie. And like a you, 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 you watch her back it up. She do that, da, 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 da,